Hello, everyone, and thank you for coming back to the channel, honey, baby. We on our messy flight. Yes, we are up in the skies, waving at everybody from below. And how they say, they smiling in your face all the time. They want to take your place, the backstabbers. Backstabbers. Huh. Huh. Low down. Dirty, dirty, yeah. Girl, or how do they say? Out with the old, in with the new. Flying in Sherry Shepherd, child, I tell you. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. And my Rihanna voice, child, she showed up and showed out. Gave us an impression that Wendy Williams had gave her the okay to come in and sit in her chair. You see, it ain't the you see it ain't the purple chair no more. It's the golden chair, and I guess that's gonna be like the Sherry Show or, or however they gonna name it, honey. But TMZ broke the story, and several other media outlets was on it, doggone it. They are really trying to push Wendy out. Throwing the bath water out and the baby. I'm like, what? So they're going to revamp this thing. But allegedly, they are saying she's still having until September to come back. But yet, they are putting Miss Sherry Shepard out saying, we got her. We don't want any other hosts coming through. We done did it with the uh, several host panels coming in doing what they had to do to try to keep us afloat but the numbers don't lie the numbers don't lie honey and i remember when sherry shepherd had a appendi appendicitis and she was in the hospital honey she told them for she can only stay for a couple of hours because she got to do her william wendy williams show so she knew something uh wasn't clean in that milk she was drinking that they was giving her or they were telling her at the time so she was like uh -uh, i can't mess up this gig because this might be a permanent gig for me because from what the streets are saying over there at wendy williams show she ain't finna be there no more because wendy got other beef fish to fry at this time especially with wells fargo and them locking up her assets okay so they just throwing every boulder that they can at wendy just showing her the elites so showing her look we can do it with you or we can do it without you you pick up and choose, okay? They being messy over there oh, at Wendy's camp. They being messy and they throwing everything out. They don't care that her mama died recently. They don't care that she recently got a divorce. They don't care about her health. They say her health been failing. <laughs> All that they care about is getting her back in that seat, making them some money. Come which way or the other, they don't care. All right. I was like, God, no, this is just a bad deal all the way around. January 2022 came in like a thunderstorm. Okay, picking them up and laying them down. Woo wee. Woo 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 wee. Okay. But, honey, that's pretty much all I got to say about it. You got to watch these folks that come up here and say they're trying to help you out. They're trying to help you get over or they trying to sit in until you can fill in or they filling in until you can sit back in, sit back in on your purpose, your royalty. Child, please. I'm like, Bertha, this is just too much. <laughs> and I'm like, do we to know, girl? Do we to know if they trying to pass the torch with you? Come in, Bertha saying they coming with the bullshit. They coming up with all this fake news to get Wendy out of her chair saying she's incompetent. She don't lost her mind. She's going through dementia, locking up her accounts where she can't pay for nothing that she needs to do, like food, shelter, and clothing. Those are the basic utensils. Those are the basic needs of life. And they're trying to oust her out with that. So while she's fighting on that front, in the back end, they're trying to get rid of her job entirely. I like, wait, whoa, hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute. Put a fork in it. We ain't through with this thing yet. We still trying to eat. But anyway, we're going to go into what TMZ brought out. Because that's the first time that I had saw it. So I'm going to give them credit this time. And the staff writer wrote as a title exclusive. Wendy Williams, Sherry Shepard to become permanent guest host. Name of show in flux. Okay. The Wendy Williams show has been a revolving door this season as the host struggles with various elements or ailments. And now TMZ has learned a permanent guest host is about to be named. And see, 
where it says guest host. That's the messy part about it because it's a two-edged sword. If Wendy come back before September of this year, then she can get a job back. And then that house 86 Sherry. So any other uh, endeavor she had going on that she was putting on hold because she wanted this to be her main gig, they're going to be gone in the air. So I'm saying, Sherry, when you send over that sign of that contract, you better be putting the contract in if Wendy come back. You still get this X amount of money regardless because you was there with the intent to be the replacement but since they're titling you as a permanent guest host that still opens up the door for Wendy to slide back into her position if and when she choose to do so so girl when you're inking a deal over there you better make sure they're gonna pay you regardless if Wendy come back or not okay same thing but anyway going back on to the story it says multiple sources with direct knowledge tell TMZ Sherry Shepard will take the reins of the show beginning in September. Our sources say the deal is almost locked and everyone involved expects it will be uh, inked in the very near future. Now, here's the way it will work. The folks who produce the show will be monitoring Wendy's progress between now and September. If Wendy gets better, there's an open door for her to return. If, however, it appears she is unable to return, then they will or they would change the name of the show as early as September, which will mark the 15th season of the show. And I'm like, girl, what are they going to name you, girl? Sherry, come on and get it. Show? A Sherry, the comedian show? What are they going to give us? Because Sherry Shepherd show just don't sound right. You know, it don't flow right. Or is it just going to be the Shepherd show? Or is it going to be Sherry show? I mean, I, I don't know because it's going to be a lot of heat on you too. Because it's like you're going to have to come up, spring up, and surpass everything that Wendy has done. Because everybody ain't going to be looking at Wendy. They're going to be looking at you now and seeing what you can bring to the table. It's good to fill in for somebody and cut the food and tell good jokes here and there. But when they're looking at you, Sherry, what are you going to bring? Are you going to be a mimic little impersonator? of Wendy or you're going to come and bring your own flavor to it well we're going to forget about Wendy because you have captivated us so much that we just into you and you bringing the good vibes you bringing this that and the third you're bringing the foolishness with a little cute twist and turn here and there but don't we can't have that chill no more because see when I see a chill I be thinking about the royal chill so what are you going to be sitting on a bed or a truck or what kind of aesthetic are you going to bring what kind of prop are you going to bring? Well, I don't want to see the chill. I mean, you could, you're going to have a living room or something. What what What's what's the dynamics? What's the environment going to look like, girl? Because it can't mimic Wendy. Because then we're going to, like, you're a carbon copy. You know, you're just imitating. Who who are you really? You know, I'm being messed over him. I'm asking all the questions that everybody want to ask but can't ask. Because they don't have a form such as mine where I can get on him and say what I want to say. In good reasoning, of course. And... You all can comment back and tell me what you think, okay? But, hey, we just being messy up here. You know, we had to be messy. Because I'm like, the first thing I thought about was like, oh, ho, 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 that song coming again. Backstab us up, smiling in your face all the time. They want to take your place, the backstab us. Yes, girl, that's the first thing I thought about. I said, Lord, that girl's supposed to be here filling in. And she's trying to take the position. <laughs> The crabs in the bucket. The crabs in the bucket mentality, people. But anyway, I guess if you see an opportunity, you're in the right place at the right time, and it has your name on it, maybe it is a blessing. Or it could be a curse. I don't know. Sure, we're going to have to figure that one out. We're going back to the article. It says, our sources say the Fox Station Group, which carries the show on its own and operated stations, is on board with the move. When Wendy stepped away from her show back in October after suffering serious complications from Gray's disease as well as a thyroid condition, this all coming after she battled COVID-19. Wendy's last appearance on the show came in on July 2021 when she signed off at the end of the season 13. Uh, tells fans she'll see them for season 14. That never happened. But the show has since continued to air with multiple uh, a multitude of guest hosts, including Bill Bellamy, Whitney Cummings, and Leo Remy. Now, Sherry will be in front of the camera soon as the permanent guest host and maybe the permanent host. 
So it's, to me, it's just like they plan, share, they plan with her emotions, they plan with her livelihood, and they plan with <coughs> her. Okay. So share, you make sure you get your check, baby. First and foremost, whether she comes back, meaning Wendy, or she don't. Get your money up front. Don't let them fall use you, girl. Don't let them use you. Because you really being used when you stepped out that hospital too soon, too fast. You had a appendic- a, what you call it, appendicitis. And they had to do a pen- pen- appendectomy on you. And you didn't even stay 24 hours, baby. You were back on the set with some kind of corset trying to hold your stomach in. I'm like, are you crazy? Are you crazy, girl? You know, anytime you go on the surgery, it's a 50-50 chance you may come back. Or you may not. You know what I'm saying? Anytime they put you under anesthesia, girl. And I was just, I'm like, did she, she did what? I said, did she not know what she had? But see, that's how that money make you run for it. So right now, it's like she running for that money. She ain't making that money run for her. So, I don't know. I don't know if it's a good thing or it's a bad thing. But it's a certain thing happening out there. And they got Sherry Shepard's name written all over it. But y'all get down in the comments. Y'all let me know. What y'all think about Miss Sherry Shepard? Is she a backstabber? Backstabber. Or she's a woman trying to uh, make it do what it do. She saw an opportunity. And she wants to take it. Okay. What do y'all think about that? Y'all get down in the comments. Let me know what y'all think. Because I'm just, I'm beside myself right now. I'm like, girl, you were just supposed to fill in, not take over. You were just supposed to fill in. How is Wendy feeling about this situation? And she's probably feeling salty about it because they ain't let her know anything anyway. When they were having guests, or uh, sp- uh, not speakers, but uh, a panelist and a uh, guest host was filling in. And then they shortened it down to saying, you know, shoot, we don't need them other panelists. They ain't bringing in the numbers that Sherry's bringing in. And Sherry has a likability to her. I'm not going to um not say that. And she's a comedian. So it could work. It could work depending on the formula and how much... um say she's gonna have with her production but you know it just is what it is they use you and they discard you they use you and they discard you so you got to make sure you're staying ahead of the game because there there is that possibility you go for so long and then they want to replace you and you know sherry shepherd may be looking at that down the road herself if wendy does not come back and she um take the reins as they say and they make it her show with her name out there or whatever they're gonna name it I'm pretty sure they've already uh, inked that too of what the show would be called. They're just not letting us know, you know. But I know they're making Wendy mad as hell over there. She can't get her food sheltered and clothed. And then they're about they want to take her job permanently and didn't give her the option of saying, hell, I ain't coming back. Don't y'all know I wasn't coming back anyway. But y'all couldn't wait. Y'all couldn't wait till me tell y'all that. Y'all had to go and make y'all move first. Make that move right now baby yes that's what Cher was telling the folks make that move right now baby uh, and when it's like huh you only go around once in a lifetime but you don't know what they did to me <laughs> that's what it is Woo, child this is a hot mess this is a hot mess honey bringing in the new getting rid of the old Taking the old and bringing in the new, I tell you. Woo! But that's all I got, y'all. Y'all like this video? Remember to comment down in the uh, comment section, okay? Keep it cute. Keep it cute now. And as my daughter say, keep it cute or put it on mute. Keep it cute or put it on mute. All right? Because I ain't got time to be blocking folks. We, we got, I got a, a strong block game over here. And some of y'all are making me want to, like, put y'all out on that porch. And telling y'all don't you come back over here to this residence unless you want to act right. You want to get some fruitful dialogue. If you want to just start a mess and just say stuff and think you ain't you, you getting away with it. You ain't getting away with it. It's just I'm just trying to I'm trying to toe the line with y'all. I'm trying to toe the line with some of y'all. But some of y'all going to get blocked. Y'all going to be thinking y'all can make a post. And they're going to be like, mm, what? What went wrong? What went wrong? We locked you out. We don't want to see you no more. Stage left. Going up the street. Going down the street. However you coming to the house. Don't come. Okay. Don't go on another name because you might just get blocked on the start. Okay? But that's all I got for this video, guys. Like and love it. I'll see y'all later. Bye-bye.